Hey everybody. Hey everybody. I um I just realized that PSO2 had been released in English earlier this year and uh I was really excited and downloaded it and like many of you GameGuard keeps bringing up an issue, an error, and won't run the game. So I've actually found a fix that works that I'm going to show you. So let's see what uh, GameGuard does real quick. I'm going to go into my Fantasy Star Online 2. Even though I will tell you servers are down and checking on Facebook, it turns out that servers... I don't know what Sega's doing to the North American players, but uh, they obviously don't want us to... Uh, flood money into this because most of you guys like me you probably played it way back in the day Dreamcast GameCube even before then just Fantasy Star Universe so I'm starting my game and you're gonna notice that up here in the corner we're gonna get some in protect game guard downloading updating and it's going to bring up an error and not run the game so here's my error that I'm seeing which is an error 114 all right, so I'm going to show you, and even if you hit send, do not send, it says something's wrong with the server, reconnect, see, there we go. All right, first thing I want to do, and it's not going to resolve, I know why it keeps trying. First thing we're going to do is go into the Sega folder and go into Fantasy Star Online folder, which for me is on my D drive, just because I have more storage space. But I'm going to go into Program Files x86, go into Sega, Fantasy Star Online 2, PSO2 underscore bin and game guard folder I want to delete this and it's basically um, let's uh, close this don't want you to retry thank you all right thank you very much going back into there which yours might be in the C drive mine's on the D and we want to delete this folder all right now it's gone now here's what I found out that fixes before I run PSO2 again I'm going to disable my antivirus protection now I don't know if you have to do this I'm, I'm wondering if I just dis disable before I run it you know after it fixes if it'll do it better you know I mean I'm not sure if I have to delete the folder each time and disabled I'm going to try and um, once it runs I'm going to try and just disable and see if it goes through so I'm going to click start game and in protect has to re-download all those files that we deleted and by having AVG off it should be able to find them all just fine my laptop might go a little bit slow because I'm video capturing all right, connecting, and it's got about 11 files to uh, to update. And maybe the servers are back up where I can actually create a character and play. Um, probably like most of you, I, I did the Japanese thing, did the English patching, and played that for a bit until it became annoying or they shut down the servers or whatnot. Personally, if Sega keeps screwing around with us, I'm just going to wait for someone to have their own private servers because... I mean, I don't know, PSO Dreamcast days back in high school was the greatest thing, man. The greatest thing. Had a big group of friends go home, get online. So what do we do? We deleted the Game Guard folder. We disabled our antivirus protection, which I'm using AVG. And then we rerun the folder, let it re-download the protect files, and look what's running. And once again, it might go a little bit slow. My poor laptop. Guys, that's all you got to do. And hopefully the fix will work for the rest of you. I know that everybody's is different. Um, that was the error code 114, I believe. And once again, it's running slow because of, because of my computer. NVIDIA... That's it. Uh, real quick, let's try to go back in without. Now, AVG is still disabled. Let's see if it'll go back in the second time without having to delete the folder. So, probably what we'll have to do is. Okay. All right. All right, laptop. All right. You good? Did you exit out right? Okay. Well, you can cut off the video now, or if you want to see if it'll run again, give me just a second to find my uh, 
PSO2. Let's see if it uh, looks like it should be done. There it goes. Just had to give it a second. And so we still got it disabled. Let's see if it goes back in. Hopefully it will without a problem. If it does, we'll just delete the folder again. Make sure antivirus is disabled. Didn't have to reinstall AVG. So let's see what it does. And survey says. Oh, keeps running it. So pretty much what you got to do is just disable your antivirus software before running PSO2. And if anything does happen, just dis delete that folder. All right, guys, hope this video was really helpful. Um, like it if it helps you. And look for DJ Norsky on, uh, on the servers. I'll see you guys later.